So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video. And mages out there, this one's for you. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Elden Ring, be sure to subscribe. So a Duelers Moonblade. An absolute amazing bit of kit that no doubt binds to your staff. Let's quickly uh, read about it before I showcase it to you in action. It is absolutely amazing guys as you can see right there a duelist moon blade sweeping slash followed by a cold blade projectile conjures a cold magic greatsword then delivers a sweeping blow that launches a blade like projectile of thrust this sorcery can be cast repeatedly and yes it can now it does cost 39 focus points which is quite chunky it requires a 32 in intelligence and that's it that's it just intelligence guys uh, so you bind it to your staff so make sure you have a staff and we're going to check it out before i showcase you how you get this thing let me let me round all these guys up come on people come on people where's the guy with the horn where's the guy with the... he's normally standing here i set him there there he is nope he pulls out his sword think nah forget his sword i'm gonna pull out my horn Ba ba, come on, come on! Is that all you got? Come on, come on, come for me, come for me, come for me, come for me! Come on, all gather up. Let's see what this thing can do. You ready? Boom boom! Oh shit! <laughs> whoa, whoa. That, if you lock on one, it's centre like that. Man, it takes them all out. Jesus. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's incredible. It does some serious damage. It really does. And the fact it can take out more as at the same time. Jeez. And I didn't even set up, guys. There's nothing really I've got on. Which helps my magic. To be honest. I mean, that doesn't do anything with this ain't a charge spell. Um, apart from my, my Cerulean Amber Medallion. My armor. Nope. Nothing. I mean, my... Who says Glintz on stuff? Let's lie. It's the best in the game. It's the best in the game, people. But yes, this is absolutely incredible. So, how do you get it? Well, it's going to take you a mission if you haven't already completed Rani's quest line. Now, Rani's quest line, uh, you find Rani up here in Rani's Rise. To get here, guys, you need to clear out Carrier Manor, clear out Loretta, kill him off, and then run all the way down here. She'll be at the top of this tower. Start a quest line. Simple as that. Now, about 98% through it, you'll come to this area here. You can only get to this area, guys, for you doing Rani's quest line. So you'll first come at this grace point here. You'll come up there and you'll come at this grace point right here, guys. Right here. So from here, you need to come up to here. Activate this grace and go this way. And you'll see it on screen now. There is a massive dragon there. You have to kill the dragon. You kill the dragon and you get rewarded this sorcery. It is as simple as that. Now what I will say is if you if you got here, there's three dragons around I'd say this area here. All they drop are the dragon hearts, they don't drop anything else. I've killed all three of them. I didn't get nothing for them. So yeah, ignore them. Go for the dragon here. But in saying that, I did kill all three of those dragons before I come up here and took out this dragon here. So if you kill this dragon guys and you don't get this uh a dealer's moon blade, which I think you will, you probably have to take out those three first, or those three after. I don't think you do that. So come here, guys, kill the dragon, and you'll get this incredible Adula's Moonblade, which I'm loving. I'm loving. It does consume, though, quite a bit of your FP points, but you can count that with uh, some talismans in the game, no doubt. But there we have it, guys. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more Elden Ring, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one.